New tonight, though, a South Florida man accused of grooming a 10 year old Polk County girl in order to rape her. Good evening, everyone, and thanks for joining us. I'm Wendy Ryan. And I'm Jamison Euler. The arrest underscoring how important it is for parents to keep an eye on their kids' online activities. Deputies eventually arrested him at a Motel 6 off of I-4. And that's where our Carson Chambers joins us live with the way deputies caught up to the suspect so quickly. Carson? Right, and deputies say when they got to this Motel 6 in Lakeland, they went up to room 144, and the suspect actually answered the door only wearing his underwear. They found the 10-year-old hiding in a bathroom. 23-year-old Jonathan Fundora wearing a white jumpsuit as deputies took him to jail. But investigators say the Burger King manager from Miami liked to dress up in Japanimation cartoon costumes and used online gaming apps to lure his child victim. He had games and gaming stations for them to play. Deputies say the 10-year-old's guardian came home to an empty house Wednesday and called Polk County deputies. Our deputies that arrived immediately saw a note on the bed where she, she said, I'm going to be with a female friend. Instead, investigators say Fundora picked the 10-year-old up on her street, drove her to a Motel 6, and raped her. This is one of the most sick things you can ever imagine, and our deputies got there within 35 minutes, and still it was too late. He had sexually battered this child. Fundora drove four hours to meet his victim, according to Polk County Sheriff Grady Judd, after deputies say he had groomed her for almost two months using a gaming app, Facebook, and text messages. You must know what electronic devices your children are on. Tonight, Fundora is facing capital sex crimes and kidnapping charges, and deputies say he knew the victim was 10 because he used her birthday as a computer password. Okay, and deputies got here so quickly within 35 minutes because they uh, tracked uh, his Facebook page, looked on that, found his car, a photo of his car, and then went looking at local hotels and found his car actually in this parking lot. So very quick work by deputies. We're live in Polk County. I'm Carson Chambers, ABC Action News.